this gorgeous weather. And it's almost May. All right, Habitat for Humanity is working on a very special project in Poway right now. The oldest Pearl Harbor veteran, 105-year-old Ray Chavez, he needed some repairs to his house and some brush cleared away from his lawn. Well, today, a crew of volunteers stepped in to help. CBS News 8's Kelly Hesedal joins us now with that story and what Chavez has to say about it. Kelly? Well, Marcel and Steve, Ray Chavez, so grateful for all the help he received today. Volunteers say they're just honored to be a part of this, to be able to tell him thank you. And I appreciate for everything they, they are doing now. Kindness of strangers. Painting. And fixing up Ray Chavez's Poway yard. Oh, they're wonderful. I think they, uh, to give their time to help somebody, they... It's helpless. The 105-year-old Pearl Harbor veteran and his daughter Kathleen, who is also a Navy veteran. We've lived here in this house since 1961. So everything is start, starting to fall apart and come undone. When I was younger, of course, I could, <laughs> I could do all the work. I can't do it anymore, and now I have to try to keep an eye on my dad. Volunteers with Habitat for Humanity teamed up with BAE Systems, a defense contractor, to give the Chavez home a facelift. I love serving veterans. It's a huge responsibility. These guys went through a lot, of, did their service and their sacrifice for our country. <laughs> I was at the Naval Reserve about five years before the war started. There was a moment Chavez shared memories of what he saw the morning of December 7th, 1941. I saw everything was on smoke. All the ships were on fire. I could see that that, uh, that the sailors and Marines and all other, other personnel that was on board was jumping over the side into a, a deadly sea. What happened will always remain with him. He's lucky to be alive, very lucky. Their home special to their family, thanks to all these men and women. It now has a new heating and air conditioning system, a clear yard, a new fence, and maybe even a new driveway. It was a pleasure working on your house, serving you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Sure and you also. All thank you very much. Thank you. Hard work. That's rewarding. No, I can't even find the words to thank them enough. They do it out of their own hearts, and that's the greatest thing that anybody can do. And volunteers should be finished with the project in a couple of days. You're going to hear more from volunteers all new at 6.30 tonight. You'll also hear more from Ray Chavez, who shares more memories of Pearl Harbor. Back to you. Special day for a special man. Thanks so much, Kelly. Patriotism runs in Chavez's family, by the way. His daughter Kathleen served in the Navy from 1974 to 1990. She was the Navy's first female jet mechanic. All in the family. It is so neat, right? <laughs> All right, warmer temperatures and a perfect day to head out to Michigan.